You're only two minutes, Mr. Green. My name's Chuck. Yeah, yeah. Look, I need you to sign this release form before you go out there. Oh, and, uh, don't forget to include your next of kin. Her name is Katie. Can you take her somewhere safe? Yeah, I'll take her to the green room. Go with the nice man, Katie. Don't worry. I won't be long. your wife in Vegas. I guess you suck at killing zombies, otherwise she'd still be around! <laughs> Save it for the show, shithead. Zombies took our Willamette. They took our Las Vegas. But tonight, America, we're going to get a little payback.
He's a survivor. He's Chuck Green. He risked it all, and now he's taking home the big money. I was hoping for a better ride from you, Chuck. But maybe you just don't know how to handle the tight curves. Come on! We got it started, people! The cottage is just beginning! So right now, let me hear you make some noise! Veterinarians are looking into the problem and are examining the diets of different farms. This seems to have only compounded the problems which have been linked to the beef shortage in local areas. The zombie rights group CARE is in the news again. The protest group has shown up in the adult playground of Fortune City, which was chosen as the site of the latest installment of the pay-per-view game show, Terror is Reality. The protest just compounds the problems of the game show, which has been plagued recently by tumbling ratings and controversy. CURE was on the site of the show to display their opposition to what they call the unethical treatment of zombies. Stacey Forsyth, the leader of the Nevada branch of CURE, had this to say. Let our government know we will not stand for their systematic neglect of the infected. We must take drastic action now! Public opinion is mixed on the group's views, which are sometimes seen as radical. This is a joke, right? Why would you want to save those things? Stay tuned. Coming up right after the break, we've got weather and sports. Doesn't feel very good, does it? I lost my family in Willamette. I'd rather just have them back. Hey, do you know where the green rooms are? Yeah, take the elevator up a floor and then straight down the hallway. You can't miss it. The ladies were a little disappointed in your performance tonight, Chuck. But you must get that a lot. Good night, ladies.
gonna be okay now, Katie. Uh, I can't get a signal. Why? Why can't I get a signal? She, she was, she was looking right at me, and they had her, and I, I couldn't do anything. She went down without a sound, and I, I had to get out of there. I just ran. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on a second, son. Listen, it's an existing condition, all right? It's okay. It happened a long time ago. It's only a matter of time before she turns. Hey, don't worry. I've got Sombrex. Yeah, well, you better have a lot. Because there ain't none here, and the rescue ain't coming for three days. Three days? Yeah, the reserves will already be mobilizing. But their first priority is to quarantine the city, and that takes time. They'll enter the city at first light three days from now. That's the standard procedure. So we're stuck here? There's a couch in the security room. Why don't you take her in there? It's quieter. Thanks. There's a pharmacy in the Royal Flesh Mall. I'm Stacy Forsyth, by the way. I'm Chuck. And this is Katie. <sighs> Do you know a way out of here? No. But if you find one, I suggest you take this. That way we can keep in touch. There's closed circuit cameras all over the city. These monitors are playback only. But I'll keep an eye on them. Chuck, if you find anyone alive out there... I'll do what I can. Keep an eye on my daughter, okay?
What do you got? Damn! old man exactly what I'm doing I'm just here looking for some Zombrex well you're definitely gonna need some painkillers when I'm done with you well talking to you is giving me a headache oh yeah what say you give me some money and I'll go get some for you yeah give us some money grandpa we'll help ya how about it grandpa you got any money on.
Bingo! What's going on? I'm so grateful. <laughs> 